Welcome back to my channel. I have a very special guest today. Hi. What's your name? Victoria. And she's really good at makeup. I like practice with it. I'm not. Like, but she's very modest. Your status. But she wants to start a YouTube channel. Me. So comment below if you think she should start a YouTube channel. Cause look at this wing liner. It's a lot of practice, so it's been like almost three years since I've been doing wing liner. Look at that wing liner. I try. So we went to Trader Joe's today and we're going to do a vegan taste test because Trader Joe's has a ton of vegan stuff and a lot of it is pretty new. And Victoria eats vegan sometimes. When I'm with you, that's most mostly when I eat vegan food. And it's really good. The places you've taken me and the food you're giving me here at your house, like I really like it. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna try some things. And yeah, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. You didn't tell oh. them about the hike we did before though. Oh yeah. <laughs> so we did a hike this morning. We went up to Wisdom Tree. At like 11 in the afternoon. Uh huh. And then it just started getting hotter and hotter and hotter. It was a one and a half mile uphill, the one and a half mile downhill, which wasn't that bad. It wasn't, but the heat was- It was so hot. Killing us. As soon as Jessica said she thought she was gonna throw up, I was like, that's exactly how I'm feeling right now. I'm gonna throw up. But now we're better. Yeah, and so, we're gonna eat food. And yeah, it's because be we great. deserve it. Okay, so the first thing we have is this whole wheat cinnamon rolls. And it has a V on it for vegan. Not everything in Trader Joe's is labeled vegan, but this one is labeled vegan. And then this is really exciting. And I've actually, I'm cheating. So I did try this at the expo in Anaheim, the product West Expo. And this is Mayoko's cultured vegan butter, which they sell at Trader Joe's. I don't know how much it was, but everything that we bought wasn't that much more than $40, so it wasn't that expensive. So we're gonna put this on the cinnamon roll and see how it is. Oh, it's like butter. <laughs> it's like butter. Cheers. It's good. It's good. Don't be shocked if I like eat this whole thing in two seconds, because <laughs> I'm so hungry. <laughs> it's good, it's nothing like, over the top, amazing. I think if it was like a little saltier, it would taste more like butter. Mm -hmm. But it's like unsalted butter, which doesn't really have a lot of flavor, but like adding this to other foods, I can see it working mm -hmm. out really well. But it's good. I'm surprised I thought it would taste a little weird. I like the butter, <laughs> these. I think they're all right, but it, I don't know. I think if you toast them, they'll be better though. Like the texture will be kind of too. But because I haven't eaten, it's delicious. That much today, <laughs> it's amazing. That's pretty, that's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I put too much in my mouth. I've heard that about you. You know, I keep asking, I keep telling Nick, "How's your head?" And he finally gets <laughs> it now. So he's always like, "Haven't had any complaints." <laughs> You know what that means? Some watermelon cucumber cooler, which isn't labeled vegan, but there's nothing in it that would not be vegan. It has organic flavors and organic cane sugar, not filtered through bone char. Cheers. Not bad. I like it. I think it's good. I was expecting more watermelon, but I love watermelon. Watermelon is my favorite food. I think it's mine too, actually. <laughs> I, I like have been living off of watermelon too. It's I like it. I, like I think it. it's refreshing, like super refreshing. With some, um, ooh, you could probably mix this too with like vodka or something. It'd be super good. Jessica's seen me drunk a couple times. A couple times. I don't drink, so. But I think people online. Even people that I've talked to forever, they assume that I drink. Yeah, someone I was talking to, it was either Nick or my sister. They were like shocked that you didn't drink. And I was like, really? 
I think this is a good summer drink. Yeah. <laughs> Tell them what you've picked out. Oh yeah, this is the Chipotle black bean dip. They look really good. Here, do you want to hold it to the camera and show them that you're a true beauty blogger? So this is the Chipotle bean dip. You can get it at like a uh, Trader Joe's. <laughs> whatever you want. And then she picked out tortilla chips. <laughs> She's basic. I'm just kidding. But really, who watches Broad City? I love Broad City. I think it's really fun. If you guys don't have me on Snapchat, I was making fun of Victoria because she watches Broad City. And then I got so many messages of people saying, I love really? Broad yes! Yes! Those are all good. Things. I'm like, God damn it! Victoria wins! So this is just white tortilla chips seasoned with sea salt and lime. I can't open this. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna look back and see me struggling because I was like. <laughs> it tastes like barbecue sauce. What? <laughs> it says it tastes like barbecue sauce. <laughs> We're gonna eat barbecue sauce on a tortilla chip. It does. These chips are good. I like That's it. good. I don't think it tastes like barbecue sauce. It does taste like beans, but it's like sweet and tangy. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's black beans and tomato paste. These chips are really good. By themselves, they're really lemony. I like it though. I like anything chips. But you can make like bomb nachos with that. Mm -hmm. Like this, that, some like vegan cheese and sour cream. That'd be good. You've had vegan nachos, right? Huh? From Veggie Girl. Mm -hmm. I love Do they have beans in it? I haven't had them so. in a long time. I don't remember. I think they do. These are brand new from Trader Joe's. Cultured coconut milk yogurt. And then this granola is the only one that I can find that's vegan because most of them have honey in them. It says vegan right on the side. It's um, Nature's Path and they sell it at Whole Foods at Trader Joe's, like any grocery store really. And I've had this before. I'm sure Victoria's had it before too. I've had that brown. I don't know if I've had this specific. Brown. Look how good my yogurt looks. It looks nice and soft and smooth. Now look at Victoria's. <laughs> it looks like cottage cheese. Thank how much you. granola would you like? That's good. <laughs> As soon as you ask me, <laughs> like done pouring it. What? I love pumpkin seeds so much too. So I'm like, I'm living. <laughs> Do you hear all the all the granola falling on the floor? It's interesting. The texture looks weird, but it's not that weird. It's kind of like really airy, kind of like. It's a little bit weird. It's not that weird. Consistency. I had a lot in my mouth though. So. <laughs> I don't feel like it's like yogurt. Yeah, it doesn't feel like yogurt. Do you think for sure it like tastes like yogurt? Mm. I feel like, uh, like I said, this is the first yogurt I've had that wasn't dairy oh, wow. yogurt. So not really, because it's normally like a little tangy. Mm -hmm. So far, it's not my favorite, but mine it's, is like chunky. It's not bad. Mine is too. That's why it looks so weird at the top. <laughs> Look at it, like the like more? Like it's airy, but it's like look thicker it. pockets. <laughs> like it looks disgusting. It's like whipped cream. It, it's chunk. I don't hate it. It's not my favorite, but I don't hate it. No. I'm still gonna eat it. Yeah, I would eat it. Mm -hmm. I'm so gonna eat it. The granola though, bomb. I fucking love granola. This granola is so good. I really, really like it. And it doesn't have bee vomit in it. You're welcome. This is probably the most exciting part for yeah. both of us because we both love sugar and sweet things, but the yogurt was pretty um, sweet. But this is a uh, strawberry coconut milk ice cream. And I've only ever had the soy one. Hello. Uh, <laughs> Hello. <laughs> the soy one that tastes like Cherry Garcia. But I love strawberry. Do you like strawberry? I love strawberry. I love ice cream. I love anything sweet. So. And this is like coconut yeah. milk, right? 
and it, it's nice and soft because it kind of melted mm -hmm. a little bit. This is really good. That's bomb. Like really, really good. Mm -hmm. It's really good. It's very strawberry. Have you ever had non dairy? Oh, you have ice cream? Mm -hmm. Okay. I've had the Ben and Jerry's. Mm -hmm. And um, sometimes David and I will get like coconut milk ice cream. Mm -hmm. The So Delicious, mm -hmm. is that the brand? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We'll get that sometimes. That's pretty good. It's good. I like this one a lot. Because it kind of is, it reminds me of a sundae, like a strawberry sundae. Mm -hmm. Or like a shake. Yeah, a strawberry milkshake. Mm -hmm. I don't usually do strawberry. Just because it's so hard to find vegan, I think. But I think this one's good. That one is good. Last but not <laughs> least, non-dairy mochi. Is this the one you're most excited for? I don't, I think I was most excited about ice cream and, well, both ice cream. But you don't love coffee. I don't hate it though. I don't love it, but I don't hate it. I love coffee. Every time I see you, at least have, are you either drinking a coffee or you just got done having a coffee? Every day. And I work at a coffee shop and I'm like, whatever about coffee. Have you had mochi before? Yeah, I've had mochi. Okay. I've had mochi. They have a really good mochi at Ralph's. I don't remember the brand, but I posted it on my other Instagram, at Bunny Approved Living, which, I'm not that good at posting on. <laughs> I try. I love mochi because it comes in this cute little container and it has something like flour on it. I don't really know what it is, but I think it's the rice flour, so it doesn't stick, right? Mm. Ready? Uh. Do you actually I like, like it. it? You do? It's like kind of chocolatey almost too, because mm -hmm. it's like dark flavor coffee. Oh. It has like socks on the inside. It's pretty good. It's good. And it tastes like mochi. It's like coffee. Like coffee mochi. Coffee mochi. It's bomb. Bomb! Do you have a favorite? That's what I was gonna ask you. What was your favorite? Well off camera I was eating more of the butter and I was getting more of a butter flavor. That was really good. Wait you were eating the butter? I wasn't just eating the butter. <laughs> I, I didn't like, even notice. It was another half of the oh, yeah, yeah. little bread thing, uh -huh. and I was like putting it on and eating uh -huh. it. And I was getting more of a butter flavor. Mm -hmm. um, but that wasn't my favorite. It was really good though. Like honestly, I was super impressed with that. But I either like the granola or the watermelon drink. Okay. So what would you buy anything again, or would you recommend it to a friend? Mm -hmm. Not that I shop at Trader Joe's that often, but. This is kind of a special day because I never get a chance to go to Trader Joe's. Yeah. Um, I think I would get the ice cream again. Mm -hmm. But honestly, if I had to pick between the cherry soy creamy and the strawberry one, I would probably pick the cherry, the one that tastes like Cherry Garcia. That they sell that at Trader Joe's. Yeah. Oh. It's really good. I love cherries though. Yeah. We bought cherries earlier too when I came back to Jessica's house. Half of the box, like the box was this big. Half of the box was gone already. So she I loves cherries. Love cherries. Watermelon so good and cherries. Real. That's her favorite. My favorite food. foods and mangoes. And mangoes. Love, love mangoes. Um, I would buy the butter again, just because I feel like it would come in handy. And I do like that it's not too salty, so you could put it in a sweet dish or a savory dish. That's true, yeah. Like, you could do a lot with it. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's not just meant to, like, butter something. Butter your muffin. Do you want me to assign <laughs> someone to butter your muffin? <laughs> <laughs> Comment down below who should, butter, who should butter Jessica's muffin. Comment down below. Everyone. You can go shave your back now. <laughs> <laughs> I did like all of it. My least favorite was probably the yogurt, just because it was, like, Weird. It didn't really feel like yogurt, but the flavor wasn't bad. Like, no, the flavor it's a good flavor. There. Like after eating it, it's like okay, I like it, but it, the consistency is just really weird and like not liquidy. Yeah, it's like not it consistent. <laughs> yeah, it's not consistent. Yeah. it is so pigmented. It's. <laughs> <laughs>
I thought this was a food video, not a makeup video. What did you sign me up for? I know, it's really weird not having makeup in front of me and just having food. It's really weird. But if you like this type of video, please give this a thumbs up so I can know to do this in the future. If you like Victoria, you can go follow her on Instagram. Yeah, or my Snapchat. Snapchat. I mainly post on Snapchat. Really embarrassing things. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, if you want to see embarrassing videos of <laughs> Like her freaking out about where I told her we have to go, where the little flag was in the Snapchat. Oh. I was like, we're, that's where we're going. Yeah, I have this little yeah. flag on this huge mountain. I couldn't believe I hiked that much. It was fun. I'm really exhausted right now, but it was really fun. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video and follow me on Instagram and Snapchat and Twitter. Thank you guys so much for watching and see you in my next video. Bye.